Hello, good morning or good evening to everyone. Welcome to Mainframe Tutorials. You are watching Mainframe Tutorial PL4 Part 1. So this will be the introduction tutorial about the PL1. So, so far I have been sharing a knowledge about COBOL, JCL, CICS, and DB2 and the practical tutorials about all the mainframe modules. So also thought of like uh, sharing uh, something about the PL bar 1 bar, uh, PL bar 1, so which is very very uh, useful and which is uh, still used uh, by many of the companies and uh, so thought of uh, sharing the same. So this would be completely a free tutorial. Uh, so I would I would be posting a couple of videos about this PL uh, PL PL programming language one. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the introduction. So PL bar one stands for uh, language one, and it is a structured programming language that is used to support mainly for scientific computing, business programming, and data processing. So when it was developed, it was uh, introduced in 1965 by IBM right so the key feature it is a free flow language it supports the pointer it is more faster compared to a COBOL and it supports auto storage no need to declare a storage uh, name I mean the number like in COBOL we declare like a pick of x of 9 or 9 of 9 and everything so no need to declare thing it is a auto storage and it has the sub programming and functions we call here it as a main program that is divided into subroutine procedures and function procedures. Okay, it is also called as a general purpose log programming language. General purpose language. And earlier, uh, I mean, this was very much used and uh, still being used in many of the companies. So, it is a uh, uh, since it is used because it is very much faster when compared to a COBOL. They say. Uh, it is also called a general purpose language and uh, it supports exceptional handling procedure is a first statement for the PL1 uh, compiler uh, that is the compiler recognizes that it has a beginning block of the program it is the first statement that you need to code whenever you start working on this PL1 PL1 programming so option 1 I mean options main is called the main procedure or an external procedure every statement should end with colon coding sheet coming to the coding sheet as I said it is a free flow language there is no specific uh, restriction like uh, your statement should start in specific column and end, it end, with, end with column and so on so and so on so it is there is no specific uh, technique or a specific standard for coding this so we have only two things like uh, first column is reserved by OS so just give it as a blank and you 2 to 72 column 2 to 72 is used to write your statements and 73 to 80 used for sequence number that is made used by operating system so you can start coding you can use the coding sheet with the 2 to 7 2 to 70 72 columns so so these are the important features of uh, the PL bar one uh, let's see an example uh, of a simple program under this so sample program like addition add colon it should add and the procedure options main as I said procedure is the first statement that you need to quote and uh, options main is the main method and uh, it's, it's end with semicolon so get list input 1 input 2 list is the function that uh, accept the input get is a statement to extract those input so result a result is my variable input 1 input 2 or user defined variables so you can observe here like like in COBOL if we have to declare these things what we used to do input 1 colon we uh, in COBOL the COBOL we call it as uh, 0 1 input 1 a picker class x of 9 or 3 or something uh, 9 of 3 or something we would be used to code right so no need of giving this statement it accepts uh, storage dynamically depends on the value entered auto storage that's the reason we call it as auto storage so result equal to input 1 plus input 2 put list sum of two numbers and result so that's it so this is a simple program uh, for a PL bar 1 so and uh, this is since it is the introduction to PL bar 1 I would do I'm not going to tell you about more things so in my next videos I will be coming up with details details about the PL bar one so thank you so much for watching this video if you like uh, this video kindly please subscribe share or comment on my youtube channel 
Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great and pleasureful day.